I'm Matt Galante, you're on the list. We topped out in the low 20s today, so it's perfect time to break out those swimsuits. Nikki Mayo shows us how to survive the polar plunge around Baltimore. At number one, the cold weather water warriors are taking the polar plunge this weekend at Sandy Point State Park to raise money for the hundreds of athletes for Special Olympics Maryland. I do it because it's my way of giving back to Special Olympics Maryland for all it's done for me for my uh, 18 years of competing. So if you want to survive taking the plunge, here's a list to get you ready. If you're a first time plunger, be prepared when you come out. You should bring a couple of towels, wear your bathing suit underneath your clothes so it makes it easier to strip down. You also need to have shoes because the sand is gonna be frozen, the water's tough. We recommend that you actually coat your legs with Vaseline. We have a list of more Polar Plunge tips posted on the ListShow.tv. At number two. Baltimore Zone, let's hear it for Mesa. After 22 years in the music business, Charm City's Mesa is going to the Grammys this Sunday as a nominee. The jazz singer is up for the best traditional R&B performance for her song, Quiet Fire, off the Blue Velvet Soul album. It's just amazing that on my 10th solo album that I get this nomination. The Morgan State alumna says she won't know how to act if she wins. The nomination was my dream, so my dream came true, and winning the actual award would be icing on the cake. Let's hope she takes the cake. At number three, as long as I got my suit and tie. Speaking of the Grammys, Justin Timberlake isn't the only guy paying homage to a good suit and tie. Woodlawn's It Suits You is collecting ties for teams. We want to change the image and put them in a suit. You wear a suit, you get attention, and you get that job. You can bring the ties to the tie drive next Saturday at Birdland Sports Bar in Overly. Now you're caught up and clued in to what's happening around Baltimore. I'm Nikki Mayo.